Hiya guys, and welcome back to All the Magic, a twist on all the mods. So we're here at our dedicated blood altar, completely upgraded to level 3. 2, 2, 2, 2, 3, no, it's 3, right? Yes, 1, 2, 3. Yes, it is 3. It is updated to level 3. So what we're going to need to do now is get a bound sword. So with a gold nugget, gunpowder, glowstone, and redstone, we will do this. This will make us... A bound reagent. So what we're going to do is right here. Why not? Just do this. Drop our... Um, put our binding reagent in here. Oh, it's massive. Drop that. No, do we do we right click it? Sorry, we right click it, right? There we go. So it's now making us a blood... S oh, shit. <coughs> wow, whoa. Okay, I hope it keeps his enchantments. That's really cool. I didn't realize it would be that big. Hey, and it has none of the enchantments. So how do we... Oh, I now have a blood sword. Look at that. Now this drains from your network continuously while it's active, so you need to be careful. You don't want to end up killing yourself by accident. So, we've got that now. We need that in order to make a blood altar tier 3. So, what we'll do is, is we will go and enchant this real quick. Ah, yes. Unusing sharpness. Knockback, looting, sweeping edge, stole ceiling, stole sealer, I'm breaking. And there we go. Now we have a fully enchanted blood orb. Now if we go into here, let's go ahead and grab one of these Gaia spirits. And we'll go fight the Grim the Gaia again. So, because that's uh, honestly the best way of getting mobs in the middle of the day. So let's go over here. And let's go fight the Gaia Guardian. It won't take that long, trust me. Never does. And down we go, and boom! Right. For some reason, something I've learned about the flail knot the entire time is the fact that it... You don't have to hit it directly. You can hit to the side of it, and it will be perfectly fine. Also kills the uh, little things easy, so... Hello, come on, you little bastard. Come on! You're, oh, you're close, there we go. And kill everything else. Let's activate our blood so or blood thing here, and let's start killing things. Why can't I kill things? It's active, huh? Strange. Why can't I kill things with it? Maybe I need a blood orb on me. It's bound to me, so it should be bound to my network. Oh, that sucks. Oh well. Come on, everything. Come on. It's not that hard, is it? Alright, well, anyway, I'll go ahead and let you go because there's no need to watch this if this isn't working. So, after some various testing, I come to find out it doesn't like enchantments. So, it didn't like the unbreaking enchantment and some other enchantment. I don't know which one it was. But what we were looking for was this a weak blood orb. And we got it. So, we're good now. Let's put this away. Let's go put shove some of our stuff in the white uh, ender pouch. <coughs> so, there we go. Put this all stuff, all this stuff away. We do have some weak blood orbs, well, uh, blood things now. But with that, we're gonna have to go ahead and make even more runes of blood. Specifically, in here. So we have a lot of uh, stone, and we're going to, to grab our blood orb, one of our blood orbs, which we should have, uh, what? We only don't, we don't have any more, do we? Damn. Anyway, so take one of your blood shards and put it into here, and you will get large bloodstone tiles, which can also be used for decoration. So if you are in a mood for a nice sanguine home, remember that they can be used for decorations, but, you know, warranty and all that stuff goes by. So let's go ahead and grab this and we're going to be making well actually we don't have to leave here do we well then let's go ahead and make some things so what we're going to need to do first is grab our assembly halo and uh, do it like so and like so so let's go ahead and balance out the no I have to rotate the grid balance out the grid and then put our, this in the middle with blank slates, like so, and we'll get some blood runes. Now, <coughs> one 
What we're going to do the blood runes here is with blood runes, what we can do is we can upgrade them. We can upgrade them to runes of sacrifice. Not self-sacrifice. No, we want rune of sacrifice. There we go. We're going to need some gold. So I'll be back because it looks like I need to get some more uh, stone as it is. But let me explain to you why all of a sudden that my little furnace is covered with pumps. With uh, these things. With little arcane bellows. All I need to do is grab this. Let's see, it's, uh, do we have enough room? We should have enough room for about four stacks. Oh, we're out. Oh, well, there should be some stone lying around. I think. Oh, God. Yes, there is stone lying around. Good. So four stacks of stone should be enough for us to do our endeavor. Put all of our stuff in here. I got impatient, so I was wondering if the arcane bells can be coupled with the flower, and it can, and it works so much faster. So now suddenly we have a very fast system. But I'm gonna wait until you until it's all done, and then I'll see you. Well, again. we're finishing this up right now. I don't know how long it's gonna take, so <clears throat> we'll get these done, and then we'll finally make what we need. The last tiers. I also hollowed out the bottom here, so we can put our runes in a place inconspicuous, so you know. The dead cannot be seen. Or the lambs, should I say. Maybe I should put down a little... <laughs> Maybe I should put a little sign that puts a lotion on the skin or else it gets the hose again. Ooh, that sounds bad. I feel like a villain now. I'm not tired here no more, am I? Alright, well, come on. It shouldn't take that long. Alright, well, we got a few more minutes out of this, so I'm going to let this keep doing its thing. And, uh, yeah. Now that we have everything we need, all we need to do is grab some stone over to here and make more oh oh my god blank slates come on put everything in there please is it not gonna put oh it's because of that yeah so I have to do it like this so I have to li literally do it like this there we go let's balance the grid and make some runes there we go now let's go grab some gold. We'll grab two stacks of gold. Go down here. And what we'll do is we'll go over to this, uh, what's it called? Rune of Sacrifice, Rune of Sacrifice, Rune of Sacrifice. Bam. Oh, we're going to have to do it by hand. That's right. So like so, like so, uh, like so. What goes in the top? Oh, sorry. Oh, it destroyed everything. Why? Oh, that sucks. That goes in the middle. This goes up top. That goes here. We need to grab some more of this. Now we do like so. There we go. Now we've got things up and running. And then just take half of this. And now we just need, like, two more stone. And... We now have our runes of sacrifice. Now, I do not know what I've done with the thing. You know that thing, that uh, weird thing that we were using? It was like a handheld um, wand of equivalent exchange, but I don't think they're called wands anymore. I forgot what they're called. I just have to do it by hand. But anyway... Now that we have everything else we need, we have our runes of sacrifice, which will make our sacrifice even greater. So, let's see if we go all the way over here. Oh, we fly. And we drop. We grab our mana steel thing here. Alright, so gra destroy this one here. And so it's going to be like this. So, ooh, these runes of sacrifice look so dastardly evil. Okay, I need to get rid of that. Thank you. Grab dirt, just put the dirt like this. And like so. So we got more to do. Let's see. Okay, here we go. Oh god. The the it's too fast. Jesus. Alright, there we go. Oh god, it's way too fast. I should not have put efficiency on this thing. And like so. Should be I think it should be like that. There we go. And let's see if we can get this one a bit nicer. There we go. And just put two dirt down. And more of these down. There we go. And we got one more. Oh, yes, one more. 
Oh god. The lag is... Uh oh. Did I accidentally... Yeah, I accidentally destroyed something that didn't need to be destroyed. Okay, there we go. Oh wait. Oh god, what am I doing? Jesus Christ. Oh god. Destroy... Put that down. Okay. Right. Now. Like this. Alright, now we have... 37 left. It shouldn't be 37, should it? Did I do this right? Hold up. I'm checking the altar. It only took 28. Meaning we can replace all these. I will do that in the meantime, though. Now take your large blood tiles and we place them like so. Bam, bam. 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 And now what we're going to do is just add the last rune. And how the hell did you get out? What? How did you get out? Strange. Alright, let's see real quick. Did I do this right? I hope I did this right. No, I want to know what level... Oh, no. Can I not tell what level this thing is? Um, didn't I have a book that did that? What book was that? Is that book part of my book? Did I put that book in my book? Yes, I did. I did put that book in my book. Good. The next tier of the battle is missing. Okay, it's missing a beacon. Okay, that's good. That means that this is a tier 4. This is a tier 4 blood altar. whoop de doo Alright, now we have to actually get down to making these freaking runes and everything. So I'll be back. So this is what you have to do. And I'll replace all of these with a rune of uh, the, the other runes as well. So that we can actually see what it looks like. Um, I think we actually have enough because it's going to be 25. Uh, no, 20. Yeah, we'll have enough to replace all of this. So I'll go ahead and replace it real quick and I'll be all right, right back. So we're back. So what you're going to need to do is take like a gas tier. Let that cook up so we can make our first one. So all these are going to be doing their own individual things to begin with. I don't know how much blood they take to be honest with you. Sorry, I have to grab a stick from the inventory. At blood. All right, blood magic. And oh, it's already done. Wow, that was quick. All right, so we've got our first. We've got air tool, right? Now we want this one. And we're going to need one more. Oh god, there's, they're dying. So They're just dying. They're, I'm not even doing anything. They're just dying. Like, I didn't even do anything. All right, well, I'll be back while this one does its thing, okay? All right, so now that we've got the one from the water, now we need obsidian, which... We'll make our earthen brethren. Now, how much are these are we going to need? Well, this thing does its thing. We'll just look here. And we will check the thing for the well of suffering. Well of suffering, well of suffering, well of suffering, well of suffering. Oh my god, there's so many. Well of suffering, well of suffering. That should be a very well of suffering. Alright, we're going to need... Oh, that's a lot. Okay, so we're going to need a good few of these ritual stones. That, um... Holy crap, we need a good few of those ritual stones. And, uh... We've already got the gas here. We've already got the coal. Uh... What are we missing? Well, we've got three. That means we're missing, uh... Magma cream. That's right. So go ahead and put the magma cream in there. And grab our white guy here. And put away... This coal... I don't think uh, these blood shards that we don't need and these large bricks and these runes that we don't need right now So there we go. So as we wait for this thing to do its thing. It's there. It is now We're gonna make our first ritual diviner. So if you go like this go over to here grab a ritual diviner as you can see We're missing the diamonds. I put up my diamonds like a fool Jesus and then also while you're doing that if you put a piece of coal block in there with a tear for altar You'll be able to make the rune of dusk the beginning of dusk we're going to get these beautiful, beautiful things. Alright. So four of these, these diamonds. And if we go over here. Ritual Diviner. Bam. Now we have the Ritual Diviner. Unfortunately though, I think it still requires them. I could be wrong. But I think they still require the things. Now, the only problem is, is we're going to need a lot for the Well of Suffering. We need 32 ritual, 36 ritual blocks. So to make a ritual block, do 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 do. Blank slate, reinforced slate, to block. Oh, these are all blocks. That's actually, they look really cool. Now, we actually want to find our ritual. So here is the master ritual, which is going to require obsidian and ritual stone. Ritual stone, on the other hand, is going to require reinforced plates, obsidian, and magic blood orbs. Now, it's only for four. So in reality, that means we have to make 40, and that's 10. So that means you're going to need, it. Yeah, you're going to need 40 slates and at least 40 obsidian. We're gonna do another long while before we can do that. Isn't that lovely? So go go here, and I'm gonna put our 
or four slates like this. It can be R. Yes, do that. Thank you. All right, so our rear four slates are in there. Let's go ahead and make our two rituals of dusk. So, um... Oh, this one burns up a lot quicker. Oh, but it doesn't take that long at all. I was expecting a very long time. So that's really nice. These are really annoying. I actually don't even know how good these Wells of Suffering are. Like, they must be amazing because it's working fast. And then with that, we just need one more of these to turn into the demonic plate real quick. So, oh, fuck, Shiza. I am stupid. You out. Yes, out. So with that, we need one of these to become the new demonic plate. And it shouldn't take that long at all. I'm hoping. Sorry about the, uh, sorry about also my voice. I've been under the weather again. And again, I'm always under the weather. I'm always sick. What the hell was that? Was that lightning? Or was that all them dying at once? But I've been under weather again, so that's why I don't sound so great. Where did, where's that villager? Where is that fucking bastard? Oh, pardon my French. Where is he? There you are, bastard. All right. No one escapes the well of stuff. Uh, no one escapes this. Oh, fuck. Oh, it's working really well if that was only three hits. So we wait. And we wait. Uh, it is already night. I wonder if there's a day version of this. Imperfect ritual stone. I mean, that's pretty perfect ritual to me if it makes it night perfectly. So, uh... Oh, shit! Okay, that was only three hits. If it fills up the, or the blood altar like that, we're doing good with these runes of sacrifice. Holy crap. I am perfectly fine with that. We need runes of capacity next. How do we make runes of capacity? Because, Jesus, if this is that efficient, we just need rune of runes of capacity to hold blood. Um, that's self-sacrifice. Uh, runes of capacity. Capacity. Imbued slate, blank rune. Oh, that's not that bad. So the next one will be, the next circlet will be made with a rune of capacity. So open this up again, though. Take your two elemental dusk things. Take your actual ritual diviner, which is just a normal one. And take your demonic slates, and you now have a diviner ritual of dusk. Now, we're going to test it out, but right now I need to go make those beautiful things. Uh, we're going to need at least 40 plates, so... And they just need to be reinforced. It's nothing that strong. Unless, though, we do have to worry about making... Oh, it's not going to be bad at all. So we have to make at least 40. It's not going to be that bad, thankfully. So, uh... What, but what's in the middle? Is it diamond or is it, uh, just an orb? Okay, we're good. So I'll go ahead and do that off camera so I get to do all the fun stuff. And I will show you all in a second, okay? And now that we've been doing at this for about an hour and a half, I mean, more likely a half an hour. I don't, I don't really remember, to be honest with you. So what we're going to do is just put our stacks of things here. Balance the grid. And take out, let's see, we need... 36 and that much there and now we need them this the master stone bam so now we have our master stone and we have our ritual stone and it's about to find out if our little uh thing here which i think i need to bind it to us all right now how do i uh, make it work I think I need to like click on the. Don't I need to click on this? The ritual the master ritual stone, something like that. So I know that it is what well, I think a one block above it. So what we need to do is while we're here, I don't want to use obsidian. That sounds like a stupid decision. So like so, like so, and then just go back down here. Block of coal and ooh, that's a bit too far. Never mind. So I think right. Well, I think right actually. We do this I think right here is fair now how do we decide the ritual open up our sanguine sanctium let's see um, altar basic master activation crystal I know I'm gonna need one of those ritual of the full spring ritual diviner after descend as uh, discerning the size and layout of the many rituals I start to find a little bothersome to continue to con consult my notes in order to build the ritual so that's why I continue to create advice that will allow anyone to simply place down the stone and core in the correct position through a simple gesture and movement. I place this en entry for the list chronically because it's best for people to learn the, of the items before starting with the actual construction of the ritual. Otherwise, they have to be find out where they don't have everything they need or will summon a meteor from hell instead of a fresh bottle of spring water. The divine ritual is essentially encyclopedia ritual by right click by circling through the diviner, shift right, shift left click, and shift right click. Okay, so I'm shifting. Oh, here we go. Ritual full spring. It has to, okay, ritual. 
of the... It is Ritual of Sacrifice. I mean, it's the the Ritual... I think it's the Well of Suffering. Reap, focus... Oh, there we go. Well of Suffering. Okay, does it working? <gasps> ah, so we don't need the stones. Wait, was that the Well of Suffering? Did the Well of Suffering change? Is it bigger than it actually is? Did I mess up here? Oh no, I hope I didn't. Let's find out. We're gonna have to destroy all these. So I'll be right back. Now that I've cleared out the area, let's go ahead and see this in action. Hopefully it actually, uh... Yes, I did make it to... And that should be it. That is it done, I think. Yes! We have our stones... Wait, that's a ritual... I don't even know what kind of ritual stone these are. Don't even tell me. So, is that everything? Is that all of it done? Alright, so now we need to... Oh, activation catalyst. Now, um, if we go back here... Uh, activation crystal. Instead of putting a, waiting an hour of uh, or a time of me meditation to ritual activate, we took a red gem. Oh my god, would you just leave me alone? Goodbye. Alright, so, there we go. Okay, so we need an activation crystal. Crystal. Activation. Activation. Uh, activation crystal. Alright, so there's two types. There's a weak for more powerful rituals and creative. So more powerful rituals. Oh, no. Okay, so we need a tier three and a lava crystal. Alright, we're gonna go make it. So, um, let me go grab lava. I'll be Alright, now we have our buckets and everything. Let's go ahead and fly all the way back over to there. I accidentally made a waypoint. I don't know how the hell I did that. So, with that... Oh, look, another... A few of them got out this time. Oh! Okay, so, thankfully it's gonna be under the altar. I have to worry about them killing them that time. So, with that, we need this. And we're missing glass. Alright, let's go grab some glass. So, we got the lava. Basically, I just went on a ground, grabbed buckets of lava. Bam, there we done. Bim, bam, bosh. Only had two buckets, so I had to come back up. And then I stole a bucket of lava from the... Smithy! So, with that, we just need this. On our blood orb. It should be perfectly fine. And we now have a lava crystal. Which we're not going to bind to us. Or maybe we do need to bind to us. I have no idea. All I know is we need to activate that... Ritual with a full blood orb. Thankfully, our blood orb is full. So let's go ahead and jump, jump down here, like so. Oh, it's going fast! It's going fast! It's going fast! It is going fast! Come here, you. Come on. No, go. Be a sacrifice. There we go. All right. Uh, you, you're just gonna die. All right. Anyone else is uh? What the hell is there? Things down here? Do I have to worry about things down here? Yes, I do. Hiya! Oh, Jesus Christ. There we go. Dead. Good. Alright. Oh, now we have our weak activation crystal. Please tell me this works. Please. Please. Oh, she died. Why would it work? You feel a push, but you're too weak to perform the... You are too weak to perform a, the, this ritual. Really? Oh! Oh, it's working! Oh, it's working! Oh! Oh, it's a cacophony of music to my ears! Oh, it's filling up my blood network. <laughs> yes! Yes! The well is formed! <laughs> Suffering! <laughs> yes! Oh, this is. Oh, it just makes me so happy. I think I. I just think I maxed out my fucking mic. <laughs> Alright, come on, you. We need you. All right, uh, where is... Okay, I've got it. Good. All right, so we have our first suffering. Oh, it's so delightful. I'm so happy. And then we can put this right here. We can take this, put it down here, and it will work. Or at least it should. Please work. Oh, yes, this is actually amazing. <laughs> uh, I'm so proud of myself. I... All right, have fun, everyone. Be careful. Don't, don't, don't be stupid. <laughs> uh, now we still need that silencer block, though, because we can hear them. All right, with that though, and our beautiful orbs filling up with blood, let's get our second, our fourth tier, our fourth tier blood orb. It'll take time, lots of time, but thankfully, I no longer have to sit there and manually kill things, so I am perfectly fine with that. Oh, thank... That just... 
elated me. All right, where is that shard? Hello, you. I need one of you. We will make the fourth blood shard. And then we're so much closer. We have the Well of Suffering and so many more rituals. Look at all these rituals we can do. Now that we actually have this thing up and running and fueling our, ma our, our blood source. <laughs> so many rituals. So little time. Oh, it's amazing. Ritual of the Eternal Soul. Cry, uh, the cry of eternal souls capable of feeding LP from a soul network back into the altar. Oh, that's strange. Okay. Well, thankfully, though, we have quite the bit. And it is doing its thing. And now that this thing is just having a cacophony, continually filling up the altar over and over again, we don't have to worry about it. Now, of course, it does take a little bit of LP every single time, but that is perfectly fine because what we're going to be doing is basically having this is our this is going to be basically our blood we're going to use this as our base altar first but when we build the second one it's going to be mainly our usable altar even though by the time that we actually built this we're going to need another altar but that's fine but no it's working so we've got that working i'll be back in a few minutes show you what the new blood orbs like Woot! and here it is the master blood orb we have mastered Blood magic, but not completely. We are not the Archmagus quite yet. Because that's the one we need. We need the Archmagus Blood Orb, a level 5 altar. But now that we actually have rituals to do and a system where I don't have to sit there, I can start making things. Since we have this small system thick here, we can go ahead and make many more rituals. Many, many more. And that's what we want. We want a lot of rituals going. Actually, wait. Why am I doing that when we have a new blood orb? To fill up. <laughs> and this will continually go over and over. But I've already gone over time. Because I focus on this stuff way too much and I love doing it. So we're going to be doing a good bit of rituals next time. So that we can actually get that stuff done. And we're also going to be delving into making bound armor. Just to see what it's like. But... Well, last thing we need to do, now that we have a tier 4 altar, is we need to learn about making crystal clusters. And, well, that's level 6 altar, actually. Next one, all we really need is beacons. Beacons and about, what was it, like 72? Is it 72? I could be wrong. It could be more. Uh, before I leave, let me just tell you that. Uh, 52 additional blood orbs. Uh, blood runes. So we'll make blood runes a capacity next. But with that, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode as much as I did. Yes, it was a bit tedious, but when it comes down to getting the beautiful satisfaction of sacrificing things with no work, automation is key. Oh, it's so amazing. So until next time, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Ta-ta.